Happy Independence Day. This is Cody from Workflow Secrets. And over here at Workflow Secrets, one of our core values is being proud of being an American. And uh, so today is very special to me. Um, over the last week or so, I have gotten the opportunity to sit on my back porch and uh, listen to fireworks and kind of reflect on my life, um, the, the joys, the blessings of being an American, what opportunities that's afforded me, and then kind of think about um, the symbolism behind fireworks and celebration. And um, this morning I woke up and I woke up to the Top Gun anthem um, and uh, I made some pancakes with uh, my best friend. Uh, it's a tradition of ours. We put some blueberries, uh, some strawberries, and some whipped cream on there and kind of fancy them up into American flags. But I want to talk to you about this uh, poster that's behind me. It's actually a speech by uh, what I believe is the best president that the United States has ever had. This is President Theodore Roosevelt. Um, and I think that it's such a powerful speech because it calls to the work that you as a real estate agent do every single day. You're striving to make the world better. You're striving to help home buyers or home sellers reach their dreams. And there's just something so noble about that. And yet I would wager that you as a real estate agent are probably putting in more hours than you think that you could ever put in. Um, and you're not finding that success. And I want to encourage you, um, if you there was ever a day to encourage you, it's today, because that is the American dream. Um, and this is something that uh, President Roosevelt speaks to. And so in this uh, speech, The Man in the Arena, it's a, a pretty common or a pretty uh, well-known speech. He says, the credit belongs to the man who was actually in the arena, whose face is marred by dust and sweat and blood, who strives valiantly, who errs, who comes short again and again because there is no effort without error or shortcoming, but who actually does strive to do the deeds. And I just, I wanna encourage you because you are in the arena, you are striving, you are helping people in America and you're doing it one person at a time. And I think we as Americans could, you know, take a lesson from that in how we conduct ourselves, how we move uh, this country forward. It's one person at a time. It's making sure that you provide the best service that you can for your customers. It's being your best self. It's helping uh, people in your communities achieve more. And uh, I'm just so proud to be an American. Um, I'm so honored that uh, you follow along on this journey with us. And uh, I'm so grateful to live in a country that allows me to be a technologist um, and uh, gives me the opportunity to build a business. And I just think that there's something so special about that that I can't stop and take pause and uh, really express my gratitude. So I hope that you get to go have some time with your family, your friends. Maybe you'll make some pancakes yourself. Um, but uh, I would encourage you to really think about uh, this country that we live in. There's always something that could be done to help this country be better. And at its core, the easiest way to do that is for you to be a great American. And I know that you're on the right track, but um, man, I'm so grateful for you guys. And I hope you have an incredible 4th of July. Happy Independence Day.